Life has played a nice song for Arturo Achati and his wife Susan, and the Brevard entrepreneurs want to pay back their good fortune with music. The founder of Acoustic for a Change, Achati has harnessed the power of music to do good for local charities. The Indian Atlantic guitarist and fellow musicians here and in California donate their time and talent to nonprofits to help them raise funds at special events. They also play for donations at weddings and other private functions in order to give all the income to worthy causes in Brevard. The list of charities who sing Achati's musical praises is long, including Cancer Care Foundation, Candlelighters of Brevard, Healthy Start Coalition, the National Kidney Foundation, the Women's Center, Zonta Club, Club Esteem, Devereaux, Brevard Rescue Mission, the Space Coast Early Intervention Center, and even the Space Coast Symphony, for whom Achati played Latin-themed tunes at the orchestra's Viva La Musica fundraiser. Approximately 200 musicians in Florida and California have joined Acoustic for a Change, pledging to help out nonprofits with music, the universal language. Part of Achati's music ministry also includes collecting gently used musical instruments to be given to underprivileged children who would not otherwise be able to play. Along with the instruments comes music lessons. For example, the children of Melbourne's Booker T. Washington neighborhood live in a world where poverty, crime, and drugs are very familiar. Because of Achati, however, these kids who attend Brevard Neighborhood Development Coalition's DOC after-school program have received musical instruments that help them explore a whole new world of opportunity and beauty. Arturo uses the power of music to do so much good, says Lynn Brockwell Carey, Executive Director of the Brevard Neighborhood Development Coalition. Ichati's wife Susan has joined him in the music ministry. Her forte is organization, and Susan Ichati donates her business acumen to nonprofits planning fundraisers in order that they can maximize funds and resources to help their mission. With Susan's help, the National Kidney Foundation hosted a highly successful Gidget evening featuring Kathy Zonuk Zuckerman, the original inspiration for the quintessential girl surfer of movie and television fame, Gidget. The Cuban-American Ichati had a bumpy start in life. In the late 60s, Ichati's family left all their worldly goods in Cuba and fled the communist regime with their four boys, plus a baby soon to arrive. Arturo is the only one of the five Achati sons to have been born in the United States. Achati's strong faith in God led him to acoustic for a change. This is the purpose God has given me to do good, he says. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2012 Central Florida Humanitarians, acoustic for a change.